Hollers, hey, I'm a stunner, 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 summer, been in Hunter, cook up, hey, my crew, hey, sorry for way, hop it. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Beauty with Cat, and today I'm here to give you guys another wig review from Bobby Boss. I believe her name is JL. I can't pronounce it, but everything will be in my description box below. So right now we're gonna jump right into it. So I am going to be plucking this hairline. This is what the hairline looks like before. Y'all will see it after. Um, it probably took me about a good 20 minutes to kind of pluck the entire hairline. And even then I still went in after the fact and still pluck some more. I don't have a real technique to how I pluck um, my wigs. I just go off of, one, I go off of the hairline. I go off of how big the knots are in the actual unit. Um, I also go off of the spacing between the lace and the track, you know. Y'all know that little indent part where they kind of lay the tracks and then you have that space to pluck. Yeah, so that also depends as well. So I don't have a specific like, this is what I do every single time when I pluck um, any unit. But what I will say is I pluck along the perimeter and then sometimes I do pull out four strands or four pieces of hair along the hairline and then I pluck that. Then I kind of brush everything back, pluck the perimeter again, and then just keep on like, you know, plucking the perimeter around that hairline until I feel like it is natural looking. So like I said, this usually kind of takes me mm, on a pretty decent wig. It kind of takes me five to 10 minutes. A wig that need a little bit more work, it might take me up to 30 to 45 minutes. This wig was actually easy to work with, so thank God. This wig was gifted as well. I got this wig from Divatrice. Um, so shout out to them. I'm pretty sure you can find this wig somewhere else um, Maybe even cheaper, but Diva Tris is who sent me this unit. So I appreciate them. Shout out to Diva Tris. So what I will say about this unit, I was trying to give y'all a dupe of my RPG show hair um, I believe that unit was about three four hundred dollars. This is under 50. So y'all do the math now she isn't the same color my rpg show was a little bit darker but this one is a little bit lighter but it still had that same bounce it still had that same type of style that same type of you know feathered look so So I was debating between if I wanted to do a middle part or a side part, I ended up opting to go with a middle part instead. If you are thinking about doing her glueless, it is possible, it is possible. The texture of this wig was so beautiful. I love how full this was. I love how thick it was. It gave me uh, an outre Nisha type feels. So yes, this hair is definitely giving kinky. Now you don't wanna manipulate the hair too much because she is pretty long. Um, on me, I feel like she fell between like 24 to 26 inches. I did get a comment on my last couple of videos. I don't know if it was the last video or two videos before, 
but it was this one viewer that said that she basically missed that all the synthetic girlies have been switching over and getting over to the human hair side baby i'm gonna be really transparent with y'all i gotta pay some bills y'all i gotta pay bills i gotta pay bills my son he growing up fast he, he he's a growing boy and i can't i can't feed him with free wigs y'all i can't but with the money that i do use for these reviews i do budget that enough so i can go purchase my own wigs i got three wigs that i actually wanted to review that are synthetic that are under i believe 40 to 50 dollars um so y'all look out for those reviews um so yeah i have not i do not want people to feel like i abandoned that side of youtube like that's how I got my start is doing synthetic hair reviews. I love how I am able to finesse a synthetic wig, okay? Don't 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 count me out, y'all. Don't count me out. But yes, more synthetic reviews will be on the way. It will be on the way. <laughs> So overall, how I am feeling about JL from Bobby Boss, she is a very beautiful unit, especially for the price. Um, she's under $50. The pros with her, she comes pre-styled. This was a very easy install. Um, of course, if you are trying to pluck her, you know, spare 15 to 20 minutes of your day out. Other than that, once you pluck that down to your liking, baby, she's a hit. Now, what I will say is she does tangle and she does shed. Um, and when I tell you she tangles, she really tangles. So make sure y'all are using like a um, wide tooth comb or a detangler brush to kind of get those little bumps out. But overall, y'all see how these curls have held up. It's some wigs that you will literally put on, comb through it, and then you know them ends get to getting nappy and get in you know what i'm saying they lose the body of the curls and they become straight and then they dingy and then a mess okay this wig did not do that surprisingly so yeah that concludes today's video i appreciate you guys for coming back to my channel giving me constructive criticism giving me suggestions on what you would like to see because i would like to give that to y'all so like always thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel i appreciate y'all every single time and i'll talk to y'all later peace